Hi everyone! Welcome to my channel. If you're new, my name is Nicole. If you're old, welcome back. And I do have another haul for you. Uh, if you want the deets on my makeup look today, it was a haul and try on from Lime Crime. And I will link the video up here. And also, I wore the same makeup look in my uh, TJ Maxx haul. My second TJ Maxx haul. Um, which unfortunately I didn't find what I wanted again. But anyway, I will link that video as well. Um, I made my first one later on. But anyway, I went to Marshalls, and you know, uh, TJ Maxx and Marshalls are owned by the same parent company. And I'm pretty sure, yeah. Anyway, but they didn't have any of the Marc Jacobs Smashbox or the Too Faced palettes I was wanting. However, Marshalls did have a few makeup products I hadn't seen anywhere else, and I almost got, but I really didn't want to pay seven bucks for a Bare Minerals Lip Oil Balm. Um, I almost got it. They had like a uh, poppy shade, which was like an orangey coral, and then um, a pink one. I almost got that, and then I put them up. It's like me. It's like I really don't want to spend seven bucks on lip oil. I may or may not wear. <laughs> like that. But anyway, this is my haul. If you like this type of video, please like and subscribe down below. I tend to do a lot of hauls on this channel if you are unfamiliar with me. But I think I did get a few good deals, or quite a few good deals, and I. Oh my gosh, I was so tired. I didn't say this in my Teaching Max video, but I was so tired. I went right after work on Friday, and I did not get back home. Of course, I had to stop at Walmart, but I got to Walmart like at 8.30. So, I got home at like after 9, 9.30, something like that. Like 9.30. It was like after 8.30. <laughs> so, I spent like an hour and a half in each store just browsing. I don't ever go that way. I, never, I didn't even know um, how good they were. Okay, first thing up that I got... And this was on clearance for five bucks. And this is BH Cosmetics uh, Contour and Blush Color Palette. Um, this, I think, is about $10 on their website. And I opened it up, and it hasn't been swatched or anything. It has, like, and these pans are huge. Okay, fairly light. Look, it's bigger than my face. Um, or it has big as my face. Um, so, yeah. It's like... These are kind of like calling to me, these colors. I think I actually swatched that. But, um, yeah, these two. <laughs> I may or may not keep this palette. I haven't decided. Oh, that's good. I barely swatched that. Look at that blush. I barely tapped it. I just tapped my finger into that lighter one. Okay, I don't even know. Let's see. I just tapped. Wow, okay. <laughs> I may or may not keep this. I haven't decided because, yes, these blush colors in that contour shade are, like, right up my alley. But I do have a few contour palettes. I do have a few blush palettes. I just didn't know whether I was going to keep this or give it to my niece. Uh, but these, if they were lighter, I'd probably definitely give it to my niece. Um, so, I don't know. I'm thinking of that because she's going to get those elf palettes that I have that I really don't like. Um, so, yeah. <laughs> Or my, it just takes too much work to build them up and have them last and they don't last on my skin. So, anyway, I got that for five bucks. I also went ahead and got this mirror. I'm going to, like, make a hook thing or something to put it in my bathroom. So, I have it, like, right here if I am, like, so I can actually see if I have time to do my eye makeup. I don't have to have a palette necessarily with a mirror. I can just, like, put it up on the wall. But it's a 15 times magnification. Um, and it was seven bucks because the ones that had stands were just exp crazy expensive and only like five times my vacation. So I went and got that. I also got this is the only leave in conditioner I saw, and I needed another one because I went through my Briogeo Rosarco Milk. Like, I tried to use it today, it's empty from Ipsy that I got last month, and I got like last month, like my Ipsy brag took forever to get here. But this is from Organistry, Organistry, <laughs> Argan Oil. Um, it is keratin smoothing leave-in conditioner. Delivers a smooth, glossy style. Hair feels thicker and softer. Enriches organic argan oil. Um, no phthalates, whatever that word is. No parabens. No animal testins. Made in the U.S. Uh, tested on people. <laughs> but anyway, it's a ginormous bottle. It's eight ounces. Um, they had a few of these. Well, they might have had one more spray and conditioner, but it did not have a cap. So, I was like, man. Um, even though I'll lose the cap, I just didn't want to bring it home and not have a cap. Um, 
but it says compare at 10 but anyway it's 5.99 and I was like no idea whether this smells good or not so we're gonna spray I have a little bit I forgot I had some um it's a miracle or it's a 10 leave-in conditioner from a while ago but that Rosarco milk had higher standards than that one. Oh, you smell even more like coconut you know, I'm not smelling argan oil. I'm smelling coconut. Ooh, I like you. Because <laughs> that Rosarco milk kind of had like, it's, Rosarco is like apparently coconut or something. Um, that Briogeo one. And that thing's $20 a bottle, right? And $9 for a sample size. So, but it had a slight coconutty smell. All right, and also I saw this. And I know this sucker's like, what, $13.99, something like that. Uh, this physician's formula, nude wear, glow and nude bronzer, um, for $5.99. This is compare at 10. I want to say that's more than 10 at any store. But it's like, it hasn't been opened. It's physician's formula. I don't know if I'll wear it. This might be like one of their actual, hey, like, you could actually wear it. <laughs> Cause you know, they just go for, you know, lighter skin tones. If anybody's wondering, my lovely nail polish is Stingray Chrome by Pretty Woman. I didn't do the best job painting and I was kind of impatient for it to dry. This is why it's chipping on the ends, but I'm kind of in love with it. <laughs> anyway, <laughs> that was like, it's a thick thing. Yeah. Okay, come on. Though. All right. Course has the cutest little thing. Okay, that nude stuff wears off. It's like glitter, glitter, glitter. It's basically a highlight, like, because of that. I don't know. I'm going to try it out see how it works. I don't think it's going to be bronzer on me. I'm thinking it's going to be more like a highlight, at least until all that stuff wears out. So, I think five bucks. Can't go wrong. It's just in this formula for five bucks. This next thing I caught, was in full I almost got some plates too, but I was down the aisle, is this lovely thing and I've seen people use these things for makeup palettes so cute I could display because I have deeper weld buckets from Dollar Tree that are like pink which I love but this is so cute hashtag brilliant it was on sale for six dollars um they did have a white one but I kind of like the seafoam green color I was like I'll display some of my prettier palettes like up in here you know I need more room so I'm just gonna like display some of my prettier ones in this I was happy about that. And I, was happy about that. I actually had two bags. Two bags. Next thing I got. More impulse, but I did like this mask. It's the Tony Moly Amrill. I'm telling y'all, don't buy from Ulta. I mean, Ulta might have to buy one and get one half off. These were like $3.99 at Ulta. $1.49. It's this at 250 now they're 399 and also um 149 i'm real and it's the poor care mask and i did enjoy this one so i just picked it up also got another foot peeling one for 199 and the only one they have at ulta is like six dollars so, yeah, i got this nail polish not like i need another nail polish but i don't have that exact gold color <laughs> and it said essie and it was 399 Okay. Next thing I got, I got two of these. Now, when I went to the other TJ Maxx, um, they don't have Marshalls by that one. Um, they had the Real Techniques eye set, but it was more like the liner set. This has the uh, uh, buffing and like that's an angle tape for buffing, packing. I don't know what it is. Okay, that's a crease brush. That's fat for a crease brush. Uh, this is a tapered base shadow brush, uh, accent brush, fine liner brush. Oh, I could have used that for my cushion ones if you didn't watch that TJ Maxx haul. Uh, and that one is a brow brush. That's a brow brush. No wonder I don't use it right. <laughs> but it just has a case and these were $6.99 a piece. I got one for me and one for either my niece or my mom. I haven't decided yet. So I have got my a couple ones. Alright. Next thing I got 
Anyways, okay, these, the mask and the Estee polishes were right before you checked out. Like, you walk through these little aisles because they get you. They just pile stuff there, and I was digging for it. And this was on clearance um, for $4. It's the Makeup Forever Artist Plexigloss Duo. I'm sure this was like a Christmas thing or something. It's been beat up. It's been around the block. I'm sure. I'm hoping it hasn't really been washed too much, but I never know. Oh, it looks really clean. I don't know if that dough fit's supposed to have that little hooky in it, though. It doesn't smell like anything. So, I doubt this is going to be my color at all. Um, it's slightly sticky. <laughs> I don't know if that's age or just whatever, but I was like, okay, for $4, I'm going to buy some Make It Forever cloth. And I don't know where that other one went to. It was like rolled and disappeared. <laughs> the other one was red. I don't know where it went. It just disappeared. Okay, there it went. Okay. Now this is a pretty color I can get behind. It looks does look summery. It is in this shade. It does not say pears around. They don't say. But you know, I have that uh makeup palette I got for twenty five. Unfortunately they had like volume three go on sale. I'm like, and I missed it. I guess it sold out of Sephora already. And I'm like, it was that $25 finally. Okay, no, that's apparently the weird shape of these doe foot applicators. Okay, that one feels better. But they are really pigmented. So I will definitely wear that one. The pink one, um, I don't know. That might be going to my niece because that's really bright. Um, but yeah, I was like, hey, you yeah, make it forever. Alright, next thing I picked up, because I have been using my little hand cream at work, is this. I have, I actually use it if, like, it's out. This is from the Body Shop. It sets in my hand cream. And Satsuma's orange, so that makes sense. I think, right? Yeah. It says orange on it. It's $1.99. They had a bunch of the body butters, but I'm like, I don't have time to work in body butter in my skin most days. So I'm like, I like the quick lotions. <laughs> and next thing I got for four, is on sale for $14. I don't believe this has been opened. Uh, yeah, because it looks like your original packaging. And this is the Juicy Couture Hollywood Royale. Uh, Royal. Um, you got the 4.2 body lotion. You got the 1.3 ounce of the toilet spray. You got the 0.3 ounce of the toilet spray. I didn't know they were toilet instead of perfume. So, yeah. Anyway, but it was $14. They did have the Versace, which I almost got, like, the Versace crystal that I almost got because I've been wanting that. And then, but they were, like, $29. And I was like, no, I still got to go to the grocery store, it. <laughs> which is why I didn't get home until almost 10 because I had to go to Walmart afterwards you know, for cat food and whatnot. <laughs> Mostly cat food. I'm like, I would have avoided another store if they didn't eat cat food in litter. If you just heard something run by, that was serious. <laughs> it tends to interrupt my videos now more days than Boo does. Boo used to, oh, you always saw Boo like in my earlier videos. Because like I'd film in the living room and he'd you'd see his tail as he walked by in front of me or <laughs> behind me. Or jumping around on around the TV. He's less, uh, I would say annoying back here than, <laughs> oh. Okay, I'm gonna have to get this out because I really want to smell it and see if I like it. I don't know. I don't smell these that often. Like, I don't get any juicy for like samples. Like, I took a chance with that Couture Lala because I knew the notes, but unfortunately, these don't say the notes on them at all. Forever very pretty little gold glitter cap. Find something to spray. Hold. Oh, that's nice. I didn't think I'd like it from smelling the cat, but it doesn't smell like that. Oh, it's just, I don't know, fresh and 
a little musky so it's a little heavier I would probably like go late summer fall to this um, but it's not like heavy heavy winter you know what I'm saying but it is like a sweet and spicy musky floral because you get like notes of all of them mixed it's, it's good I'm like happy I got this yay me <laughs> Like, just buy stuff for me. <laughs> no, I do buy stuff. So anyway, thank you for watching my uh, Marshalls haul, and I do plan on going back. It might be like a monthly trip, and of course, I won't. I'll miss things, I'm sure. But I found a new place to get, especially the TJ Maxx in the other city I went to was just stock loaded on face mask. This one not so much. Um, Either the Shady Max or Marshall's, not as much, not as much uh, facial care as well as the other one I went to. That the one was, had a lot and had a lot of, um, it had more hair care than the Marshall's did and the TJ Maxx, really. So that one had more skincare and Marshall care, and I found more of the makeup at the TJ Maxx in the other city. Yeah, but the first one I went to had the more skincare, had the more skin mask, and the hair stuff. So, um, though I do think, I they're I think they're more expensive on purses at TJ Maxx and Marshalls than like Rosses. So, and I didn't explore Ross. I want to now. So I want to see if they actually have makeup now. <laughs> so I had heard that some people had found some like higher end makeup there. So I kind of want to see what it's about. Um, anyway, I'm gonna try to get this off because it's sticky <laughs> and spugging me. Um, but I did find some things you know you can't find anywhere else and. I enjoyed walking around and I had to stop myself from buying shoes. <laughs> but, um, but yeah, thank you for watching. Doodles.